Hello, good afternoon, Simon. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon, how are you today? I'm fine. Okay, that's good. Simon, did you go to school? Yes. Okay, did you enjoy it? Is it fun? Yes. Yes, okay. You look like you did not have fun in school. Are you sleepy? No. No, all right. Well, anyway, Simon, once again, I am teacher Maria Lynn of 5 1 Talk. So, Simon, are you ready for the lesson? Yes. Okay, very good. So, here I want Simon to listen to the teacher carefully, and I want Simon to look at the teacher. Okay? Okay. Okay, very good. So now, Simon, since you are ready, let's move on to the next page. So here, what can you see in the picture, Simon? Two. There are three pictures. Yes? Two. His father, Tom and Cindy. Okay, Sam and Cindy, Timmy and his father. Now, Simon, do you remember what this is? Do you remember the name? Is it an elevator or an escalator? Escalator. Okay, very good. It is an escalator. Can you say it? Escalator. Okay, very good. So, Simon, let's have a review today. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, very good. Now, for here in this lesson, for our review, you are going to review what you have learned in lessons number five, number six, and number seven. Okay, so now let's start the review. Let's move on to the next page. First, let's look at the pictures and let's have a warm-up. What can you see in the first picture, Simon? What picture? Can you see it? S escalator. Very good. Say escalator. Escalator. Okay, very good. How about number two? Do you know what that is? Number two is? It starts with letter S. S T and ends with letter S as well. Number two. So, do you know what this is? S T A. S T A. Okay, Simon. Let's read. Stairs. Stairs. Okay, very good. So number two is stairs. How about number three, Simon? What is number three? Yes, elevator. Yes, very good. It is an elevator. Now let us answer the question, Simon. Which picture above shows an escalator? Let's circle. Where is the escalator? Yes, very good. This is an escalator. Now, Simon, do you know how to take an escalator safely? Do you know how to take an escalator safely? How do we ride an escalator? Uh, go down and go up. Yes, when you ride an escalator, you go down and you also go up. Now, what should you do? You should. You should go and down and elevator go down and go up. Okay, very good. So, 
the we can say the escalator the escalator goes up and down goes up and down okay very good now what should a person do when riding an escalator are you going to hold something no. are you going to hold here i go to home with a okay. later Okay, so you can say, you should stand straight. Face forward. Okay, face forward. Face forward. And hold the handrail. And hold the handrail. Firmly. Firmly. Okay, Simon, let's read again. You should. Good. Uh, stand straight. Stand straight. Face forward. Face forward. And hold the handrail firmly. And hold the handrail firmly. Okay. If you ride an escalator, you need to hold the handrail, okay? okay. This is the handrail. Okay, now that's all for the warm-up. Let's move on to our lesson. Let's review lesson number five. Are you ready, Simon? Yes. Okay, very good. Now here, let us match the words to the pictures. Okay, let's match. East. Fine. North and located. Now, Simon, I want you to read the first word. It's Let's read. East. Fine. East. Very good. The second word. Fine. Fine. The third word. North. North. And the fourth word. Look. Okay, I want you to say located. Located. Okay, very good. So these are the four words in lesson number five. Okay, very good. Now let's go to the next page, Simon. Let's circle the modal verbs in the dialogue. Let's circle. I want Simon to read. My, I have the orange hand. Hand? Okay. Yes, mm -hmm. you may. Okay. Now, which one is the modal verb here? Modal verb. Modal Do you remember? Verb. Modal verbs add meaning to the main verb. Examples are must, shall, will, should, would. Okay, so these are the examples of modal verbs. Must, shall, will, should, would, can, could, may, and might. So in the sentence, in the first sentence, which one is a modal verb? Modal verb. May. May, okay, very good. May. How about in the second word? Yes, you may. Which one is the modal verb? May. May, okay, very good. Now let's read the second sentence. Can I go to sleep now? No, you must finish your... Homework five. Okay, so in number one, can I go to sleep now? Which one is the modal verb? Can oh. I go to sleep now? Um. Okay, it is can. Can is the modal verb. 
How about in the second sentence? No, you must finish your homework first. Which one is the modal verb? Must. Must. Okay, very good. So when you say modal verbs, they ask permission, okay? okay. Modal verbs ask permission. Okay, so that is for modal verbs. Let us complete the role play. We can use the words from the hint box. Okay, Simon, let's read. Mary is the school in the... Uh, in the... Sign of our city. Okay, so the answer here is ease. Okay? Ease. ease. No, okay. it's in the sign of our city. So the answer is... Fine. Okay, the answer here is north. Okay? North. Look, north. And here is the school. All right, oh. now let's read. Oh, I remember it. It's beside a mall. Right. Mall. Say mall. Mall. Okay, so the answer is. Uh, located. Okay, say located. Located. Very good. And number four. Yes, let's is it on the map. Okay, so the answer here is find. Okay. Okay, so now Simon, let's have a role play. This is Simon and this is teacher. Okay. Okay, let's read, Simon. Let's have a role play. Mary, it's the school in the east of our city. No, it's in the north of our city. Oh, I remember it. It's beside a mail. Oh. It's located beside Located. a mall. Right. Uh. Yes, let's find it on the map. Okay, very good. Now on the next page, Simon, let's review lesson number six. Let's complete the sentences using the words in the word bank. Soon it's talking the... What is in the picture? It's later. Okay, Up very good. There. Later, it's, how about number two? It's handrail to show cats. Okay, so the answer here it's is polite. To see his shoelace. Shoelace, very the good. Lady holds the handrail firmly. Okay, so let's look at number four, Simon. This is a handrail, okay? Okay. It is where you will hold. Now here, this is not a handrail, okay? Okay. Okay. Now here on the next page, let's make sentences with need to. I am hungry. I, I need to. am hungry, need to finish my homework. Oh, it's a <laughs> Okay, I... Uh, how about the second one? I finished my homework, need to, before I go to sleep. Okay, or you can say, I need to finish my homework before I, I go to sleep. Finish my homework before I go to sleep. Okay, very good. So these are the sentences with need to. On the next page, let's read the passage, Simon. What should you do 
before you get on the ele elevator. Elevator. What I should you do? We need to be quiet and polite. Okay, so this is the first one. I need no. to let other people. I need to let other people get off first. Okay, how about number two? What should what you do? What should you do while you are inside the elevator? Do you inside the elevator, you always need to be quiet and polite. Okay, say polite. Polite. Okay, very good. Now on the next page, let us talk. How does the lady go upstairs? She takes the elevator. To go she upstairs. She needs to be quiet. Okay, very good. She needs to be quiet. Okay, good answer. Now here, it's time for Lesson 7 review. Are you ready, Simon? Yes. Okay, now in Lesson 7, I want you to match the pictures with the sentences. Let's read the first sentence, Simon. Yes. They disagree. They disagree with each other on where to go. There is a new factory in the desert. Okay. Dinosaur related the earth for around uh, 165, 165 million years. Okay. All the Students go to the aquarium. Aquarium. aquarium on, on a field trip. Okay, so the answer in the fourth one is number four, okay? And number one is number three, okay? Okay. Okay, now on the next page, let's make sentences with disagree with. What gift to buy for their daughter? Daughter. Okay, let's make sentences. Disagree with. Disagree. You can. Okay, you can say they disagree. Disagree. With each other on what gift to buy? With each other to give to buy for, for the their bear? daughter. Okay. And the second one? Disagree with you depend with each other. Question. Okay, or you can say, they disagree with each other on, on their vacation. On where to spend. On where to spend their, their vacation. vacation. Okay, so these sentences always have disagree with. When you don't want to agree with someone, you disagree. Now here, let us complete and role play. Let's read we, the hints. We, okay. We should we go for the uh, field trip? Very good field trip. What did Lily say? We should visit the dinosaur okay. museum. museum. What do you think? Oh, I 
say I field trip. Okay, I say I disagree. I disagree with you. I want to visit the chocolate factory. Okay, chocolate very good. Factory. It sounds like a fun place. Okay, good answer, Simon. And now let us have a role play. This is teacher and this is Simon, okay? Okay. Okay. Lily, where should we go for the field trip? We should visit the dinosaur museum. museum. What do you think? Okay, Simon, say museum. 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 Okay, museum. Museum. Okay, good. Oh, I disagree with you. I want to visit the chocolate factory. Chocolate factory. It sounds like a fun place. Okay, good one. Now here, what have we reviewed today, Simon? Reading a map, elevators, and escalator. Safety. 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 Planning a field trip. Okay, it and for the keyword, it's find nurse located. Okay, say located. Located. Okay. How about the it, next word? Escalator. Okay. Two legs. Handrail. Collect. Okay, Air say. Polite. Polite. Very good. Field trip. Dinosaur. Disagree. Factory. Okay, very good. So here we have three topics, reading a map. And now I want Simon to read again. Say, elevator. Elevator. Escalator. Escalator. Okay, how about this? Safety tip. Safety, Safety tips. tips. Yes, very good. And for the third lesson, we have planning a field trip. And these are the four keywords in lesson number five. I want Simon to say located. Located. Okay. And these are the words in lesson number six. Say polite. Polite. Okay, good one. And these are the words in lesson number seven. Now, Simon, on the next page, let's read the sentence pattern. Before you get on the elevator, you need to let other people go up first. Okay. I'm sorry, but I disagree with you. Okay, good. And for the grammar? Modal verb. Modal verb. Modal verb. Okay, very good. Yeah. May, must, I can oh. read it too. Okay, so in the sentence, which one is a modal verb? Can, may, must. Okay, so in the sentence, can yeah. is the, yes, very good, can is the modal verb. All right, Simon, so this ends our review for today. I hope that you can still remember everything, okay? Okay. Okay, I'll see you next time, Simon. Goodbye. Have a good day.